Are you troubled by strange noises in the middle of the night? <laughs> Do you experience feelings of dread in your basement or attic? <laughs> Have you or any of your family ever seen a spook, specter, or ghost? If the answer is yes, then don't wait another minute. Pick up your phone and call the professionals. Go Ghostbusters! Ghostbusters. Our courteous and efficient staff is on call 24 hours a day to serve all your supernatural elimination needs. We're ready to believe you! I could give you a hug, man. The vodka, why do that? Why? Oh, I, believe me, I didn't need no, another gig. I had enough to do. Vodka is an old Russian word for vodka. Is a of course, with crystal head vodka. We're going to start off adding a little bit of ice as our base. This is a built cocktail right into the glass. So we're going to be two ounces of our crystal head Aurora, our wheat based version. We just want to build this right up to the top. We'll see you in a few minutes. Does Dan Aykroyd consume his family and friends? Now again, this is 10 years of consumption. Hundreds of people here on the property over the years at the campfires and the fun we've all had in moderation. And the result is my collection. <laughs> yes. Not a prop. These are all empty skulls on the Rock River in eastern Ontario. Yes, yeah, see, they're lonely now. Empty. In every bottle. Uh, a meaning brought to it by the people, close friends and family. And you know what? We'll be adding more. Or to come. Uh, we're going to go from here to the old farmhouse where uh, you'll see the seance room. Um, and that is the room in which Ghostbusters was born. So see you downstairs. Well, hello, everyone. Welcome to the old farmhouse here on the Rock River in eastern Ontario where Ghostbusters was born. And and the thing about it is, prior to the Ghostbusters, no one knew what ectoplasm was. Now millions of people know what ectoplasm is. Because research, that's where the spiritualist movement started. And, uh, and, and, uh, uh, seances in this room here. And growing up, I, I uh, had all these seances in this room here. Ghosts and mediums and seances. Here's a picture that was taken at Lilydale by uh, a photographer. And it's of my great-grandfather, Sam, writing at a desk. And as you can see, there are all these disembodied heads. Now, it was faked. Ghostbusters. And I love this painting. This was done by a fan who depicted a poker game. And it's kind of like a seance. All the characters are sitting around. Strange seance photo here. And if you turn that upside down, that little white thing at the top there is actually a skull. And uh, so where do, you, where do you go from Ghostbusters? Well, I was sitting on the porch of this house back in the, I tell you, the 70s. And I guess, well, late 70s, yeah. And uh, I was reading my great-grandfather's journals, which you can get Rodale Press, A History of Ghosts. Um, 
Rodeo Press, Amazon still has some on the story of Ghostbusters. I'm sitting there and I'm reading and, you know, I'm thinking, and, you know, I'm thinking, wow. And, you know, I'm thinking movies, uh, comedies. And so that's, that's where it came from. When you're driving this car, yeah, I have to look at this, uh, this little guy's butt the whole time I'm driving. And not that it's unattractive, really. You've never seen or tasted anything like this. Listen, people, you gotta watch out for that damn fella. He thinks he goes real, man. He's on the wacky tobacco. He's all over the place, man. I go over to his house and he's rambling all drunk. He must have had about three or four skulls in him. And he's like, my daddy was a ghost hunter. I'm like, yeah, you told me a thousand times. That's why I'm not doing Ghostbusters 3. Because you're a goddamn crazy man. And I'm tired about hearing about your dad and your seances and your... Listen, just look at me and this little fella back here just enjoying himself, having fun. He's, he's seeing God right now. Don't worry about it. But, uh, watch over Dan Aykroyd. He might uh, try to grab you a little, you know, grab you a little pants. He's like, touch your weenie. You know, not for Bill, no. Not happening. In Ghostbusters 3, Yes, sir. I'm not asking for a part. If you put me in, I'll do it. Of course, I love doing no, this. No, no, it's... And what happens... In, can, what, what, can you, can you, what can you tell us about that? Well, basically, well, I can say that the, 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 the world or our dimension that we live in are, are four planes of existence. Murray doesn't want to do it, right? Billy uh, has done the role twice. Uh, he is doing spectacular work as an actor. You saw him in the, uh, in the, high, uh, in the high, I love him. Uh, he just doesn't want to reprise the role. However, new Ghostbusters. We need four new Columbia well, students. You know one of them, right? Well, I, I'll be there. That, that, that casting job's easy. You know? <laughs> and then, if, and I, and then, of course, uh, you know, we're going to be doing you in your new format. As, you know, with you, could... yeah, very nice. Yeah, there's no. Oh, uh, oh, oh boy. Oh, oh, oh. oh. <laughs> yes. Here. A full torso apparition, and it's real. I know. Do exactly as I say. Get ready. Ready? Get him! Oh, oh boy.